room, especially here in New York. Yeah, definitely. This and like our PR just went up, and they finally done the quote unquote sensible thing and put the victory reasons uh like the city, NYC, Long Island, Westchester. Now they're all condensed into one PR and. Well, it's always been like that. I don't think we just said it. <laughs> As a person on the panel. Tears. <laughs> definitely, I'm definitely seeing a lot more Westchester come up, though, which is good. Yeah, Westchester, they put in the work. They, they got the, they got the results. All right, but now we have the game starting right here. And this is also not a matchup traditionally known Diddy likes. Mm -hmm. This is set to, like, Pikachu can... I, I can't think of many characters who like fighting Pikachu. Sounds yeah. like... Game and Watch, Ness, Ma maybe Mario. Mario. Uh, a few others here or there. But, yeah, Diddy's definitely not one of the characters on that we just listed. Mm -hmm. With the fact that you can just snipe Diddy by just back throwing him and then just proceeding to edge guard him. Uh oh. And, yeah, oh, just getting hit by the barrels. I'm surprised Mouse Rider didn't pick up on that. The uh, Inferno definitely watched a double jump in that little skirmish earlier. Yeah, but wasn't like secure if the banana was theirs or not. So just That's didn't fair. overextend. That's fair. Okay. All right. Yeah, and ready. I, I like up, the attempt. Yeah, ready picking up the fact that mouse that Infernape does not want to land into corner mm -hmm. like to grab, but is landing on stage to recover, which is really big. All right, what's the edge guard sequence? Oh, snipe the monkey flip. Yeah, and this is where it gets hard. Lucky for Inferno, he got out, but there's ledge trapping right there. Pika is one of the characters that does have a really good ledge trap. One, Go. Some could say you cannot ledge trap this character, yeah. as most characters in this game. Yeah, but it's the one of the characters that can ledge trap you. True. So well, easy flow chart. Uh, F Smash able to cover neutral get up and roll. And then it's so Bear absurd. just able to cover jump. How that move yeah. is. But now we're seeing also... T Jolt able to just play the game for them too. A lot of people say this ability to just put out a constant hitbox is so powerful. But we're already starting to see Inferno starting to get used to the pattern. Backer is not going to take it right there. Not yet. Next one probably will if it's at ledge. Yeah. Or and, just dash tag. Yeah. And you see again going back on stage, just not comfortable going to the ledge right there with the barrels. Definitely playing a big part right there. Oh, I do like to say play right there. Right. Down throw not going to do anything. Oh, good. Mm -hmm. Slid a little too far. Yeah. And Shades Fernie, of Brawl. Yeah. And Fernie really trying to force the issue right now, which is not good. He's starting to see the dashbacks, but now Mouse Rat has an opening 42%. Oh, went back to reset with the banana this, instead this, of continuing the pressure. Yeah, this is the thing, though. We're, like, each player's mental game is different. Yeah. How would you approach, like, a lead that's getting farther and farther away from you. Yeah, no. It, it's like you, you have to make something happen, but at what cost? Yeah, it, you got to choose your options widely. I know you do have to take a risk somewhere, but uh -oh. forcing issues just not going to work. That's not going to kill right there. Did Force Smash not have done it with that I, much rage? I actually don't know. I feel like it was it was the small stronger move, but I'm not the Pika player, so yeah. Miles Rat, Miles Rat's the professional right here. All right, dash attack on shield. Oh my God, thunder out of nowhere! Yeah, that's that's something I learned. I didn't know Pikachu could just mash thunder, f and even if he's hit frame one, the column still comes down, which yeah. is very annoying. Yeah, it's, it's looking like there you okay, go. I'll smash out there. That guy's cheating like ashes, Pikachu, right there. I know he's wearing the Gen Six hat, but he's in the wrong game. There, there's a there's a Kalos Ash Pikachu hat. There's one for all of them. Yeah. That's just Going not. into Gen 7, I think. All right, up tilt. Okay, not getting the combo. I'm liking these resets, though. So, like, Mouse Rat knows, like, oh, I don't usually get these combos, but people usually do a panic option here, so I'm just going to reset you for, like, a bit more damage. Which is cool. And it plays into, like, you've probably heard, like, in discussion, like, one of Pikachu's quote-unquote weaknesses is sometimes he can't kill. Yeah. Which... You know, it's, it has come up here and there. I'm, only, I'm not going to say, like, it's completely unfounded. But when you could do Death by a Thousand Cuts just as well, uncontested, I mean, do you really need the kill if they kill themselves eventually just running into your nonsense? True. Okay, call it the monkey flip. Ooh, oh, yeah, he... it connected that time. 
if he did down a little bit before then, that was probably the game. Yeah, and this is getting a lot harder. Okay, just do it. Why not? If you're Infernape. Oh, no. Oh, tried to get for the read right there. It's just not working out. Monkey flip. Oh, okay. That'll do it. Yeah. Whew. Right. Mouse Rat taking game one. Infernape, uh, I saw the fist go up like, I could have done it. I could have been a contender. It weren't completely out of it. No, not, not at all, but... To say to say it was anything less than an uphill battle would be frankly lying. Yeah, yeah. It started off pretty uh, semi close, and then Mouse Rat able to take those first two stocks before losing their own. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and you were still going to see the DDL smash. That's when Infernape took the one and only stock. They took the set, and then yeah, no Mouse Rat just able to clean it up. It's all and, good. And Mouse Rat banning FD and Town. No. This is, oh yeah, Mouse Rat, I'm sorry. No, you're good. Yeah. And for name going Callus, I do know they do love that stage. They do? Yeah. But so does Pikachu. Yeah, I know. The ability to have T-Jolt ride right up the walls. It is so, oh, hello. What? Getting the home team, home, uh, hometown advantage, rather, switching to Greninja. We're getting ourselves a Pokemon battle. In the Pokemon League, one of two? Yeah, Gen. Gen 9's not out yet. But you guys feeling the excitement? Absolutely. What start are you choosing? Uh, I am in on Foy Coco. Oh, okay. Foy Coco boys out here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going with the cat. Of course you are. Sprigadito? The the predictable one. Even if it, even their name is fun to say, Sprigadito. I just like the cat. No, yeah. I just like cats, dog. So you so you are were a Litten main is what you're saying? No. All right, sure. Okay. I was a pop Leo man. Shout out to the Quacks. Shout out to the Quacks Leaves fans out there in the chat. <laughs> oh, all right. Now, speaking of cat things, I just noticed one of the cat ears fell off Mouse Rat's headset. Yeah. No. Well, he's playing Gimp. All right. Oh, okay. Able to dodge. Back to the game. Now, yes. Yeah. So Infernape has been keeping us much more competitive than uh, yeah. game one so far. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Yeah. I actually started off with a strong lead, but Mouse Rat's now bringing it back. And. This is really hard. So I think one of the hardest things is adjusting to opponent that switches characters, mm -hmm. like especially mid set. Which is uh, something not a lot of players do. I think honestly, I'm open to the idea of people like switching on win or loss. Yeah. Just to uh, keep their opponent guessing. And I mean, again, 86 plus matchups. How many Greninjas have you seen yeah. around these parts? I fought. MGW last uh, at Xenosaga. Oh my god. Or excuse me, not uh, at the Arcadian. Uh, I'm going to stop you right there. I, I did see that. That I, was I, like I watched, 80 T jokes right there. I, I did watch all that happen while I was uh, on that tirade. He, he this had, is why he, Pikachu loves this stage. Yeah, he, this guy had him on loop. You would have thought it was like a Marvel Infinite right there. Mm -hmm. All right, I like the patience right there for Mouse And this is what they're known for. Being one of the more patient players in the game and in our scene in general. Okay, but down tilt fair, gonna close it out. The good old tried and true. Yeah. Whoever knew that down tilt fair is our savior. I didn't. But I wasn't reading the good go gospel of that. <laughs> so. Oh, right. hello. Yeah, dash attack, up smash. Just getting a bit more damage. Gotta watch how you land, though. Like, Greninja is known and neutral for his egregious use of uh, jumping full-op nares to yeah. get the party started. And, you know, it varies from match to matchup how effective it actually is, but uh, paying dividends so far. Yeah, Pikachu also being super low to the ground definitely feels a lot harder for this to happen. And sh shout outs to, like, Mr. L, former PR player. Brother also plays Greninja, j yeah. So th this is probably a matchup they see at home. <laughs> All right, up smash. Not going to close it out right there. We are on Kalos. Not going to do it yet. The next one probably will. Praying that uh, Mouser doesn't fall out of it. Hopefully they don't. Whoa. Oh, yeah, almost caught them right there. I, li I like the attempt. All right, forward throw. Oh, down throw. I like it. Yeah, mixing up the DI. And that's just going to close it out right there. I actually don't know if up throw and down toe, you have to DI differently to avoid thunder. 
Because it's right, not we, it's we not one it's not a move you see too often. Yeah, we can ask Miles Rat later, but right now, this, this move is hidden. Right now, in front of wants this game three. That's it. Yeah. No. Oh yeah. wow. Yeah, down smash not gonna take it right there. It's not one of the stronger ones. I was I was fully expecting up smash, but uh, didn't quite pan out this time. Yeah. Up smash hits more verticals. This one like more horizontal. So. I see why they went for it, but I also went on the longer side. Now, we haven't seen any use of Substitute yet. That's also effective against T-Jolts. Yeah. Probably just not thinking about it. Oh, missing the grab. Either not thinking about it or holding it when they least expect it, which is yeah. a very valid thing to do. Yeah, but you're almost you're about to lose pretty soon, so... Yeah, if, if you know about it, better pull it out soon. Um, okay, I'll throw? throw? Yeah, it okay, is. They did not DI that, right? Yeah, it's all right. <laughs> Miles Rouse like, I'll give you that one. Careful. Oh. Yeah, there it is. Damn, dude. You just floated there. She's like, you're going to you're going to Hydro Pump. I'm going to catch you because I'm super effective. Yeah. The set goes to Mouse Rat. Yeah, and that was such great babysitting. We're going to see it. Yeah. Four, five, six, six eight. Okay, oh, yeah, okay. just make it back. <laughs> All right. And Mousetrap taking this pretty handily, never really in a, like a threat range of like losing it, if I'm to be fair. Right. Like this This was a much better game than the previous one. Yeah. The Diddy wasn't too, too bad, but clearly Greninja is effective better as a character in this matchup. Yeah. And like this last stock right here, this is like such great sharking right here. So they jump that off, babysit. That all the, happened because he didn't air dodge. Tech. Oh yeah, my threaten God. the air dodge. Boom. And then, like, yeah, you have no options because you went low. Because if, if Mouse Rat went for that fair mm -hmm. and Infernape expected, they air dodge, dude. But he's like, nah, I'm not going to do it. All I know you're going to do it. I know you're going to air dodge. I just needed to wait. 